part two, the second chunk. Starts the same as the first part. You're now familiar with it. You moved it all around. We're going to play that F. Then we're making our transition to the four chord, which comes up next, that B flat. So it's just another F chord is what that is. An F7 chord there. Start with your first finger barring everything. And then you drop in your second finger on for that E flat. Now it's important you hit the pickup note of the F before we move into our four chord, which in this case is going to be a nine, just because it falls easy under the fingers. Just because it falls easy under the fingers, I like the way it sounds. Now the problem with this one is the previous chord, you could hold it, let all those notes ring out while you play the melody. With the B, you can't, um, unless you've got some crazy dexterity that I don't have. So you sound more like a horn section because you st stab that first chord and then play the rest of the notes like this. We're doing the same kind of thing. So it's repeating that. That's just going from the five to the three on the next chord. Um, <clears throat> so what you should be practicing for this second part now is that move, okay? That to make it sound smooth, we're gonna go. Okay, so that's your second part, and I'll see you for the third part.